Mackey Motors in Lake City is the place to find new and certified used vehicles. With a knowledgeable sales staff and amazing service departments, you'll drive away satisfied. Find new roads at Mackey Motors in Lake City. MackeyMotors.com Jeff Lightman joined here today by the uh, South Central Calhoun girls at Sprint Medley team as we started off on this Saturday morning here, the final day of the 2024 state track meet. We're going to talk to a young lady who's gotten to celebrate her birthday down here at the state track meet, Olivia Johns. Olivia, you started things off today. How did you feel here today? I felt like I was going pretty fast. I felt good. How did you feel coming out of the blocks? Good right away? Good. yeah. Any nerves or anything, or did you feel pretty comfortable? I felt comfortable. Okay. What's it like to get a run down here? Huh? What's it like to get a run down here? I don't know. Nice. Nice. Fun. nice. Fun. Yeah? Pretty so what did you do to celebrate your birthday, getting to celebrate a birthday down here? I got, oh, I went shopping and I spent right. some money. <laughs> I sure did. So yeah, we probably can't promote the businesses, but did you hit a lot of different ones? Or a couple um, specifically? Maybe just one, two. Mainly just one or two? Yeah. Okay, so you had a good birthday is what you're saying. Yeah. All right, perfect. Well, I tell you what, enjoy the rest of your weekend, and thanks for joining us. Thank you. You bet. Let's move over now to JC Gravy. You've got to run that second leg here today. For you, what's it like to be back? Oh, it's just, it's a great feeling. I mean, it's good weather. You love like seeing all the people. Like I don't know, it's just so fun to be here, no matter what. I saw you and some of the girls walking around on Thursday morning, so you were able to kind of spend the, the few days down here. Yeah. What did you soak in while you were down here? Uh, you know, like just to kind of enjoy everything. You know, you watch everyone, and it's fun to watch people win, but also just the feeling of running down here is like it's so surreal. I don't know, but. You just got to soak it in. What was it like running the back stretch this morning? It was good. I mean, it was a 100, so I knew it was going to go get over <laughs> quick. So I just soak it in, but also just focus on what I was doing and make sure the stick got around. Did you feel like you had a good run today? Oh, yeah, I did. I was definitely a little amped. I think I got out a little <laughs> quick on live, but I mean, you know, it is what it is. Great place to finish up the, the season though, right? Yeah, yeah. It was definitely good to be back. So well, I tell you what, congratulations. Thanks for joining us. Enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you, you too. You bet. Let's move over now to Maya originally who had another outstanding run here, the 200 for you today. Yep. How'd your handoff with JC go? I think we had a really good handoff. I mean, we normally have decent handoffs. We work hard on those in practice, so. How'd you feel early in the race? Um, I definitely felt like I was, I mean, obviously I was chasing, we were in lane one. But I felt fast. I just had to remind myself, relax as fast, and that's how you are able to hand off the fastest. How different is it to run in lane one, something you guys, you girls, you really aren't used to? Um, during the season, we really don't get quite on the edges like that. Last year, when we were here, I ran in lane one, too. So that was kind of comforting that I was able to do the same routine as last time. But yeah, it was a little weird to be on the inside like that. What did you take away from last year that maybe helped you prepare for this year? Um, you just have to remember that all these people that are here aren't actually watching just you. So don't really feel like you have thousands of people actually watching you. They're paying attention to everything around them. What's the thing you're looking the most forward to the rest of the day? Um, the rest of the day I'm looking forward to just soaking up the sun, being able to get a tan, and watching Chloe run. I tell you what, great job as always. Appreciate you Thank you, Jeff. Us. You bet. Let's move over now to Anna Hopper. You got to run that 400 today. How'd that one feel out here? Um, I'm not typically a 400 runner, so it was kind of hard for me, but I tried my best and gave it all I got. When they said that you were going to get a run down here, but it was in the 400 and the sprint med, what was the first thing you kind of thought of? Um, I was really excited, but I actually wasn't typically going to run the 400. Maya was supposed to, but then we decided to switch it up. So I was excited, but I was definitely nervous at the same time. Do you think you become a 400 runner now? Probably not. I specialize in ones and twos, and I know I do much better in them. So what are you going to take away from the experience of getting to compete down here? Um, really getting to spend time with the girls was really fun. It was just really cool to see all the people here and just experience what it's like to see some of the best runners in the state comp compete together, so it was really cool. Well, I know I saw you down here with the group on Thursday, so for you, what's your favorite moment that you've seen so far down here? Um, definitely all the people breaking records. I swear we've probably seen at least 15 people break records in the last two days. So it's really cool to get them to get to watch them do that. I tell you what, great job. Appreciate you joining us and enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you. You too.